Hello viewers, welcome. Today we are going to discuss a problem of trigonometry which is based on trigonometric identity where two equations are given and you have to prove the following identity. For that, you have to first square on both sides of the first equation and it will become s square sec square theta equal to 1 minus b tan theta whole square and it will be 1 minus 2b tan theta plus b square tan square theta. Now put the value of s square sec square theta in the second equation and you will get 1 minus 2b tan theta plus b square tan square theta equal to 5 plus b square tan square theta. So from the both side of the equation, cancel out b square tan square theta. So the equation becomes 1 minus 2b tan theta equal to 5. So minus 2b tan theta is equal to 5 minus 1, that is 4. So tan theta equal to 4 by minus 2b equal to minus 2 by b. Now from the second equation, you can write s square into 1 plus tan square theta. As we know that 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta. So replace the value of sec square theta. 5 plus b square tan square theta. Now go to the next place. We have got the value of tan theta is equal to minus 2 by b. So tan square theta is equal to 4 by b square. Now we have the equation s square into 1 plus tan square theta equal to 5 plus b square tan square theta. Now put the value of tan square theta in this equation s square into 1 plus the value of tan square theta is equal to 4 by b square equal to 5 plus b square into 4 by b square. This implies that s square plus 4 into s square by b square equal to 5 plus b square b square cancel out. We have only 4 here. So s square plus 4 s square by b square equal to 9. Therefore, s square b square plus 4 square equal to 9 b square. So students, you have seen that how easily from the two given equations the identity is proved. Carefully check all the steps and practice. So thank you.